What's up everybody, it's Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you an extremely quick way to toggle on your flashlight using the power button on your Android device. Now you don't need root or anything for this to work, all you'll need is one free application called Power Button Flashlight. So why I personally like this is because the GS4 does not come with a quick toggle to activate the flashlight, and I'm not one to use lock screen widgets, so when I'm trying to navigate through a dark hallway, I have to unlock my device, do all this. I might get it wrong on the first try, unlock it, swipe, look for the widget, and press it, and then it'll turn on. Now, you'll notice that the widget is pretty ugly on the Galaxy. Of course, I can update it, but that's how it works right now. So, to do this, it'll be extremely easy, and all you have to do is uh, launch the application, and it'll actually enable the service. I've already launched it, but you'll get a pop-up. It'll tell you how to activate it with a three three press action in a three second window and it will actually require four presses if your device is unlocked now we'll go over the settings there are a few things you can do uh, hit power button within how many seconds I'm just gonna keep it at three but you can go anywhere from up to five uh, now there is a option to switch off the power sorry to switch off the flashlight using the power button but this is actually a upgrade or sorry an in-app purchase of 99 cents which will also remove the ads but I'll show you a way to actually toggle it off that's also pretty simple then there's auto shutdown after however long you can go up to 20 minutes you also have a few other options like the vibration after you navigate sorry after you activate the flashlight but let's go ahead and just show you how you how it works so let's say it's real late at night I'm coming home actually I, don't even, I won't even do that it's coming home real late at night I just press it three times and the flashlight will turn on. But to turn it off, I will have to unlock it unless I do that in-app purchase. But you can actually just pull down and tap the notification and then just turn it off right there. So it's pretty simple and it's extremely convenient. But definitely check out the full guide on gadgethacks.com. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for some more awesome gadget hack videos. Thanks guys.